and we're recording. All right, all right. Up, down, left, right. Ready? All right, we'll give a little bit of up trim here. Didn't require much trimming at all. All right. I'm still trimming, Mr. Josh. All right. Yeah. Come this way. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hold on. I gotta keep trimming. There we go. All right. Just keep Ready? trimming. Just keep trimming. All right. We're gonna go ahead and uh, enter into our pattern now to see if we can reproduce the effects. Okay. Now, Josh, I'm going pretty much downwind now. What's it look like at the moment? A little rocky, but it looks a lot smoother. It's not so jerky. Not so jerky. And we're turning. Go down the road. How about now? Yeah, it feels more stable. Yeah. Unfortunately, vibrations happen. Right. So if you have a vibrating airplane, your gyro is not going to do as well. So you want to make sure you balance out the prop and make sure your airframe doesn't vibrate at all, or else your gyros are going to give you a false, uh, false compensation, I guess you could say. Here goes round two. Yeah, it's holding stable a lot better. A lot better? Yeah. And I think it's even a little bit windier too, isn't it? Yeah, it'd be keyed up a little bit. This is holding a lot more stable. <laughs> All right, let's just let's just do. Josh, do it again. try not to talk 180 degrees away from. Well, it's kind of hard because I gotta oh. I gotta look at the airplane. You know? I thought you're flying over top of us. Let me be of focus. No, I can't can't fly over top of us. All right, let's go I ahead. See, all I can see is your face. All right, stop biting our camera. <laughs> Sorry. Attention. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, Josh, how's it feel? How's it look? It's a lot smoother. A lot smoother? Yeah, awesome. there's there's some bumps in it, but it's a lot better than it was. And you can turn up the gain a little bit. You can turn up the gain to suit your needs, but if you turn it up too high, you're going to get a plane that kind of rocks back and forth real violently. Right. So once you get to that point, you want to dial it back. So it is something you can adjust and uh, make right. And also keep in mind, this probably isn't the best uh, airframe for or uh, application for 3D aerobatics. Uh, you're not going to be able to just park it up and hover it uh, hands off like the AS3X systems do with Horizon. Uh, reason being is it does limit your controls a little bit more. Even though I'm flying in aggressive, I have much less uh, aggressive controlling on my airframe. Definitely enough to maneuver it, but not enough to do uh, hardcore 3D and, and things like that. All right, what do you say we bring it in here? Huh? Yeah, it's much better. Is it? I don't feel like I'm going to puke anymore. Well, that's good because I don't want you to do that. That's no, gross. Especially not all over Chad's ground station. Yeah. Again. I even notice a, an improvement in, in ground handling as far as when you're down low. Yeah. It doesn't want to horribly dump the catch as much, too. Oh, nice. So, yeah, all around good. Good. So, long sto uh, story short, did I say that right? Long story short. Long story short. Yeah, I think that's how you say it. Okay. I'm, I'm... <laughs> that's really short. Yeah. yeah. Long story short. <laughs> no. To sum right. it up. Yeah. <laughs> to sum it up, uh, the stabilization board did work. Yep. And for about 21, 22 bucks, well worth it. I like that. It, you awesome. know, it used to be in the past that gyros were really expensive and people didn't want to touch them because they're really complicated to get set up. Yeah. Now we did it outside in the bright sun, you know, in the hot weather. We don't want to spend too much time here and it wasn't too hard, was it? It was not bad. Yep. Just take your time. Make sure nothing is backwards because if you take it off and it's backwards, you're going to have your hands full trying to correct it. Oh my goodness. It'd be awkward. Yes. So, you so definitely take your have time. some shakiness then. Yeah. If you're, if you're in doubt, turn the gains up. Make sure that movement's nice and pronounced, and then you can dial them back later. Okay. And uh, go ahead and keep tweaking too. You know, compare your videos as you go along, so your videos, you know, you use them as a measuring okay. device. All right. Nice. Yeah. All right. We well, want to thank you guys for watching. Thanks, Stone Cap Productions, for sponsoring this episode. And check out our website, flighttest.com. Read some articles. Go to the forum. The forum is really helpful. As yeah. It turns out. It is. Lots of people on there giving you some advice. Absolutely. All right. We'll see you guys next time. See you next time. That's an awesome shot. Is it? Yeah. It's, hey, you see the Have you ever seen my rendition of Riverdale? That's really good. I think it's still recording. Oh, cool. You can put that at the end. It is recording, right? Oh. Oh.